Now, here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Caitlin Cadu with KSHB 41 News. Here's a look at your headlines this Monday. The FDA has granted full approval now to the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine. It's the first vaccine in the nation to move beyond emergency use authorization. The full approval is for people 18. 16 years and older. The vaccine will still be available under emergency use authorization for adolescents between the ages of 12 and 15, as well as a third dose in certain immunocompromised individuals. With full FDA approval, we could start seeing more businesses requiring vaccines. Starting on September 6th, the Kaufman Center announced anyone who attends a public performance must have proof of COVID-19 vaccination and will also be required to wear a mask. Also today, it's the first day of school for several districts on the Missouri side of the metro. All students at North Kansas City, Independence, KCPS, Raytown, Blue Springs, Grandview, Fort Osage, Oak Grove, Grain Valley, Belton, Harrisonville, Ray Peck, and Park Hill starting class today. Good luck to the students. Now here's Jeff Penner with the forecast. Thanks, Caitlin. The hot weather has arrived here just in time for school. 76 degrees, no chance of rain tonight. Warm and very humid. We've hit 95 today, so that's day one of a potential heat wave. Tomorrow at noon, already 92, 98 tomorrow. That'll be day two, and a little bit of a breeze may help. And then on a Wednesday, 98 again. That's day three. And then we go to Thursday. Day four, day four, Friday, day five, Saturday, day six, Sunday, day seven. We need a cold front, and there is one on Sunday night or Monday that will hopefully knock this heat down as we continue to stay in the mid to upper 90s, lows in the mid to upper 70s. Stay cool. Have a great week.